Professor Andrew Hamilton, Vice Chancellor of England's University of Oxford, accepted an honorary doctorate from Tsinghua University in Beijing on April the 22nd. The award ceremony was a part of the university's centenary celebrations. Hamilton delivered a lecture after the ceremony and answered questions from the students and reporters. What impressed you most? Oh, I have always, I have been impressed each time I have come to Tsinghua. I came uh, a little under a year ago. That was my first visit, but I knew a great deal about Tsinghua before I came through the many scientific publications in my own area of organic chemistry and many other areas of science. And I also knew much about Tsinghua from my work as Provost of Yale and Vice-Chancellor of Oxford University. And so coming now today to join in the celebration with so many other university leaders, the celebration of Tsinghua's 100th birthday, it is a particular pleasure to see the enormous progress that Tsinghua has made in 100 short years. Oxford University is nearly 900 years old. It has taken us a very long time to get where we are. Tsinghua has made enormous strides in only, I can say, only 100 years. I was delighted that in my talk this morning, one of the questions I was asked was by a student who was, had recently been ex- accepted into the biomedical engineering program of Oxford University. And so she was a perfect example of the benefits of globalization, the benefits of collaboration between world-leading universities in different parts of the world. I am very pleased and I have great uh, uh, admiration for Tsinghua students who come to Oxford. We have had many students over the past few years from Tsinghua. I am pleased that Oxford students also come to Tsinghua. But I look forward to the collaboration between our two universities increasing and expanding in the coming years. Tsinghua University students, like all students who are accepted to Oxford University, are very excellent students. We, uh, we, we take a great te- deal of time and attention to select the very best students throughout the world, whether from the United Kingdom or from Tsinghua and other universities in China. We want students to come who have a passion for their subject, who are committed to studying their subject at a very deep and a very intense level. And I have seen great success and excellent qualities in the Tsinghua students who have come to Oxford. I have been enormously impressed, as I, as everyone in the world of science, I, I will speak about my own subject, science, uh, by the enormous increase in the number and the quality of research publications that I have seen through my own work coming from scientists at Tsinghua University. So I know the world of science very well, and Tsinghua is becoming a very significant player among other leading universities in the world in in science. And as Vice-Chancellor of Oxford, I now see that across the spectrum of, of, of scholarly areas. And so I think there is great, uh, there is great success and, and confidence that, that Tsinghua University is on a trajectory. It is on a trajectory to, to become one of the very finest universities in the world. It still has a little time to go, 
and it will still be a number of years before we can make direct comparisons with the very best universities. But the progress that Tsinghua has made, the, the enormous contributions that we see from its scholars and its students give me every confidence that in a few years' time it can take its place among the very greatest universities in the world. And I will not sing happy birthday, but I will be very pleased to, to wish Tsinghua University a very, very happy birthday on reaching a hundred years. I have to confess that Tsinghua is the youngest looking hundred year old I have ever seen and that young look comes in its strength, in its vibrancy, in its clear, in, in the way it has its eyes very clearly set on the future. I am joined by many university presidents this weekend here in Beijing to come together and to celebrate with all of the students and the staff this very exciting day. It is a recognition of past achievement during the past 100 years, but actually more important than that, it is a celebration of the successes that will come in the future, in the next 100 years for Tsinghua University.